Hey guys! Essence just released a new setting spray, it's called glow to go Illuminating Setting Spray. I was so excited when I saw this one in stores because I don't have any truly illuminating setting sprays yet. And I also love the original one from Essence, the instant matte one, so I thought I'm gonna love this one as well. Let's first see what it says on the bottle. The illuminating setting spray gives you a delicate glow effect on your complexion, thanks to fine light reflecting particles. Additionally, it fixes and protects reliably your makeup with blurring effect. Sounds very nice, doesn't it? But unfortunately, I really dislike the mist on this one. It leaves so many droplets on the face and because it's illuminating, they're sort of pearly and they don't really blend or dry on your skin. Let me just show you. You're supposed to shake it and this is how it looks. I know it looks quite nice at first, but when you actually see it on the face, it leaves, as I said, so many droplets. And another thing that really bothers me, it goes everywhere. I have it on my arms now and here on my vanity table and it's just everywhere and it's really hard to get it off. Let me just spray the back of my hand so you can see those droplets. So this is how it looks sprayed on. As you can see, there are so many droplets that you would probably have to blend by hand, but you can't really do that when you have a full face of makeup already on. And this is how it looks when it's blended. And as you can see, it did nicely illuminate my hand. It also has a very strong scent, which lingers for quite a while after you apply it. Now I'm going to show you the demo of how it applies on the face and meanwhile I'm going to clean my table here because it's full of droplets. I'm having a bad makeup day today and I'm going to wash it off anyway so I think it's the perfect time to try out this spray because I have a feeling it's going to ruin everything that's on my face. So it says to shake it up well and spray it like any setting spray. Here we go. By the way, I have spray like everywhere, on my arms, on my chest, on my shirt, everywhere and it doesn't look pretty. But let's see my face. Oh my god, it's horrible. I hope you can see on the camera, but I have so many little droplets that I have a feeling will not dry down. Wow. It looks like I just pushed my head into a bucket of glitter. It looks nice and glowy if you're very far away from me, but if you're just a little bit closer to my face, then you will see that it looks horrible. And not just my face, like I said, my arms, my shirt, I'm gonna have to wash it because you can't just get it out. So as you could see from my demo, this one really didn't look cute on my face. Even if I could blend those droplets somehow, it still felt kind of heavy, like I have a, I don't know, pearly film on my face. It felt and looked quite heavy, so I didn't like it. Because of that, I washed my face right after filming that demo, so I didn't do a wear test, but I wouldn't recommend using this one as a setting spray anyway. Maybe this one could work well underneath your makeup, so as sort of a priming spray, but again, you're gonna get it on your clothes, on your arms, on everything around you, so I would just pass it. For a similar effect, I would much rather use Catrice Light Correcting Serum Primer. I don't like using this one as a primer directly on the skin because it sits a bit funny, but it looks absolutely gorgeous if you mix a few drops of this one with your foundation. Another illuminating product from the drugstore that I love is this Milani Prime Light Face Primer. This one sits beautifully on the skin and it really gives it a beautiful soft glow under your foundation. And the last product that I would recommend is my new favorite setting spray. It's called Dewy Glow Fixing Spray and it's from Catrice. This one claims to be illuminating, but it gives your skin more of a natural finish. But anyway, if you combine it with any of the primers that I mentioned before, you will get a beautiful illuminated effect. I always feel so bad when I give a negative review, but this one really didn't work for me, so I would say save your money and rather spend it on something else. I hope this video was helpful anyway. If it was, please give it a like and consider subscribing so we can see each other next time. Bye! Essence just released a new spray. Essence just released a new setting spray. It's that's a good start.